welcome to the BFS E! News Podcast. I'm Andy Cohen, your host. And this week, we are going to be talking to Kenneth Alston, who works here at Brooklyn Friends. You might meet him if you walk to Pearl Street in the morning. Uh, and he's going to talk to us about his work here and also another job he does on the side. And we'll also be talking about the music, that's a hint, uh, that the will music. be coming up in uh, at the gala early next week. But first, your sesquicentennial moment from the class of 1960, Camilla Church Green. Being from an enslaved history where I am perceived as three-fifths of a human being, I never got that uh, experience here. I felt as if there was a philosophy that everyone had a spirit within them and that everyone's spirit was valid um, and that you could not put down another human being. I'm very sad by the anti-bullying campaigns that we have to have that are not very effective. I don't, we didn't have any bullying because we were not allowed to say an unkind word to each other. And if we did, there was a conversation about it. For example, my mother, for some reason, used the word Earl when she was talking about oil. And I came to school and I used the word Earl and someone laughed at me. And I remember the teacher taking time to have a conversation about that to the person who thought that was funny. Kenneth, welcome to the show. Oh, thank you. Thank you for having me. So, Kenneth, how long have you been at Brooklyn Friends School? I think I've been here like seven, eight, seven and a half years. Now. That's seven, seven, eight years. And, and what do you do for Brooklyn Friends? Uh, security. You are security. You're, so we meet you in the morning. You're usually here uh, at the desk in, at Pearl Street, right? Yes, I'm usually at the front door and greeting everyone and making sure everyone is coming in with their ID and that they belong here. Okay, and I guess you would know pretty much everybody that belongs here. Pretty much, yes, yes. Pretty uh-huh. much, yeah. What's your favorite part about the job? The meeting the people, that's, that's the best part of the job. I'm a people person, so uh, meeting people and interacting is the favorite part. Okay, so you have another job also, but not for the school. You are actually a professional singer, isn't that right? Singer, musician songwriter somewhere in there yeah, yeah. Uh, uh-huh and and how long have you been doing that oh i've been doing that since i was i don't know maybe 12 years old uh-huh and can you um uh tell us a little bit about your career with uh play or sang with uh quite a few major artists in the industry and um mostly uh now i work with the uh the late shows gospel choir we haven't we have a new CD that came out like about a month ago, and uh, and I'm also a bass player, and I play uh, at quite a few places around town. Uh huh. And uh, one place I know you're going to be playing is at this year's gala with the BFS All Star Band. Can you tell us about that? Oh yeah, the BFS All Star Band. Yeah, well, we got a collection of of talent from here in the school, and there's 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 a a great wealth of talent, you know, teachers and students I like. And uh, so we gathered a, a, a few of us together, Tony Soul and uh, Jessica Jones and Steve Wardman and myself and, um, and Camille. And Camille, she's a yes. singer too, right? And she's a singer also. Mm-hmm. So Camille is from the preschool. She's from the preschool, yes. A- and Tony... Uh, had been a long time teacher here. He's now semi retired because yeah, he, semi-retired. you can still see him uh, playing music in yeah, the preschool. He still comes to the preschool. Yes. And the preschool and the family center. Yeah. And then you have Jessica Jones, who, of course, is our jazz teacher. Yes, Jessica Jones. And so um, you just met recently for your uh, warm up tune up for this gig? Yeah, we tuned up a little bit. Okay. Just, just a little. What kind of music are you going to be playing? Well, we're going to try to do a mixture of, of the music that that inspired us to play. So it'll probably be like rock and roll and 
blues and jazz and R&B, you know, a little Motown, because that's kind of what really inspired me, uh, Motown, the Motown sound. So we're going to do a little bit of that, and we're going to try to mix it up. I'm going to try to mix it up. Okay. Do, do quite a few things. I'm sure everyone's going to enjoy it. I, I'm looking forward to it. I can tell you that. We did a, a holiday video here a, holiday a couple video. of years ago, and we're going to leave you with a little bit of Kenneth singing some holiday music. I see trees of green, red roses too. I see them blue for me and you. And I think to myself, what a wonder. Well, that just about does it for this week's E! News podcast. Thank you so much, Kenneth Alston, for being on the show today. Also, I look forward to seeing everybody at our Spring Gala, which is Tuesday, May 2nd, at Hill Country, right across the street. See you there. And remember to let your life speak. What a wonderful world.